Hey guys, but today we're going to be showing you how to use the skulk sensor in Minecraft. This is the second part of this is the second part of the series of how to use skulk in Minecraft. And guys, make sure to like and subscribe and let's begin. So first what you will want to do is get yourself a skulk boat. Not a skulk boat. You want to get yourself a skulk sensor. You could usually get those from ancient cities. And once you got a skulk sensor, it's like it sounds it's like it's a piece of skulk that senses something. It can detect any sound except wool or carpet. I don't have my sound on so you can't hear it make a noise whenever I make noise. It can also be used for redstone. I'm not a very good redstoner, but I'm okay at it. I could make some redstone projects. Like, if you make sound, it could do that. So you can technically make an automatic door in 1.19 or higher. So, for example, like, I'm not the best at making these, because I'm, I never usually practice redstone. But I think this is how you make it. Tell me in the comments how you actually are supposed to do it or if I did it right or wrong, because I'm not a very good redstoner. Oh wait, I did it wrong. Those are supposed to collide together. I think you put it like this. And then you put this. That just makes a reaction. Oh. I'm not really sure how you do it. But anyway, they can use it very well. They can't detect carpet sounds or wool. That's the only thing. You can duplicate their sounds by using pistons and at least two or more skulk sensors to duplicate their sounds to make them automatic so 
Yeah, I don't think this is how you do it. It can be very useful in redstone traps. They can activate TNT. Like, for example, this. You have to make sure you do it very quietly, though. I think this is good. You would need to be really careful when you do this. Oh wait, I should not put the skulk center yet. Otherwise, it will probably ignite the TNT. And then you could cover it up. And once you do that, it will look unsuspicious, and if anything walks over it, like that villager did, they will most likely be defeated. Hey, that is actually a kind of shape of an apple, that explosion. I wasn't expecting that, I was just trying to show you what you could do with that. You might know what I'm doing. Oh, wait. I did it wrong. Did it wrong again. You could basically do many things with the skulk sensor. I keep doing it wrong on accident.
Oh. I'm trying to do it properly. Probably this area is in the way. There you go. That's how you do it properly. And you could also explode lots of things like uh, you, you could explode ancient cities by using this. Just make a little noise and it just explodes. For another example, you could do this and then I don't want to do that though, I just did that for the video. And guys, that's basically it. Make sure to like and subscribe and bye guys, bye.